How you doing, everybody? Uh, I'm in the New York uh, State Forest, place I always come. This is where I did my uh, search and rescue with the drone. When I ended the video, I'll just show you what it looks like. It's actually, look how grown it is. I would never have been able to get in there. So I'm gonna do a setup video on this Ozark Trails two-person hiker tent. They call it a hiker tent, it's kind of heavy, but they list it at 7.6 pounds. Um, I took it, I opened it up already, and it's 7.6 7 pounds in the everything. Uh, the steaks alone, they give 10, you don't need 10, I think you only need 6. Uh, 10 steel steaks that are, uh, they have a pound, a pound point two, just the steaks, which is kind of ridiculous. So I'm going to use the little aluminum ones uh, that I use with my uh, trekking tent. So um, I got it down to, without the sacks and those stakes, I got it down to about five, a little under five pounds, which isn't bad. So uh, you're not going to do a through hike with it. But just for overnight backpacking and stuff like that, which I do. Uh, I have a River Country trekking pole tent. The, the not number two and it's i love it it's light it's only about two pounds but it has no ventilation and a lot of moisture so I'm, i want something even though this is bigger and heavier i want something that's going to be freestanding and easy to set up so when i'm dog camping when i set up my whole setup i can do it if i don't need the whole setup i just set up this so i'm going to do this in real time i'm going to talk about it as i'm doing it and uh I want to try to do it in one take so just watch as i set it up and this is my first time why holes holes are heavy holes are two pounds but can't do much about that so if you are two people doing it somebody can carry the poles Tent, which I like. I just picked up this top in Harbor Freight. It's a nine millimeter thick, very heavy. I'm gonna try it without flipping it down. See if I get into trouble. the light but lightweight I'm, I'm not light I guess I weigh about a pound each it's a standard uh standard clip on type of tent just like most of them are so anybody that can set up a tent can set up this one if and when I start doing bigger overnight hikes I will get a bigger Agnes double wall tent because I want a double wall tent. I, the moisture, I don't like the moisture. It's also got two holes, so in case you want a little more snug. I'm going to start off this one on the first hole. Let's see how this goes. Like I guess I'm doing this in one take. So good. All very easy. Standard. Hey, Mama Tent, Big Agnes, see the summit. They all pretty much go up like this. Let's 
it is a top hole. Which maybe out of the whole thing, the only thing I don't like about it is that this goes to the trees. I'm getting a little confused about this right there. Put it on top. Put on top here. Do it like that. Like that. Okay. And then I guess we just put that in here. Line up to that. That's kind of tight. Kind of tight. I don't like that. Feels like something's gonna give. Try on the I'm almost sure that the instruction says on top. So the reason why I'm doing this is I've only seen one video on this. On YouTube. A young guy did a pretty good video. But he didn't even set it up all the way. And he didn't do it in real time. I'm doing it in real time. It ain't gonna be that great, but okay, so that's kinda Right. Okay, so maybe now it's given, so that's going to open up the whole top really cool. Okay, this is going to be fun. I feel like I'm going to rip the tent apart. Okay. Wow. That really opened up the space. What I'm going to do, because I don't want to move the camera to the end. I'm going to go in. Lots of room. Lots of room. Very room. It's five feet wide by seven feet long. And this is great. My legs don't like backpacking tents. As the weather gets, we still have very hot weather here in the northeast. As soon as the weather gets better, I'm going to do a couple of camping trips and I'm going to do a full review on this and a full review on the uh, on the uh, maybe if I get a new tent. <laughs> And the River Country products one. It was in a few of my videos camping, but I never did a review on it. And these clip in very easy.
little tight. Okay, so this is, I'm out of breath from doing that. This is the steel stakes that came with this tent. Ten of them, like I said, over a pound. Forget about those. This is the one that came with my Viva Country. Eight of these weigh a quarter of a pound. So right there, if you switch to them. These they sell in Walmart. They're a little heavier. They're like a dollar each. They're good. But when I do car camping, I use these big steel nail things. And I don't care how hard the dirt is, you're going to get it in. So I'm just going to fasten the vestibule. Don't bring that backpack in, but car camping. And it's got the full grain fly. Okay. It's got an overlap. They say it's seam shield. But when I go camping, we'll see. We'll see. So, we got a nice vestibule. And now I'll just take the camera and get a walk around and uh, show you where I am, and that's it. Uh, initial thoughts, it looks really good. It looks really good. Rest of you, very roomy. You can pull it tighter and the fly can go closer to the ground. It's got all the screen netty, so it's double wall with screen all around. Not going to have a moisture problem. I think it's 42 inches high in the middle. Which I don't know if you see when I laid in. I put my leg up and couldn't even hit. Well, I'm short, but that's another story. Okay, so that's it. And I'm over here with my Jeep. There's a uh, dispersed camping. The only thing that's here is a fire ring. And some, you know, you can put another tent over there. Put another tent here. If I fit two wherever I am there. And that's where my drone was. When I lost my drone, it's really high. The things are like 10 feet high now. I never would have been able to get it. So that's it. I'll do a follow-up on it. Uh, see how it holds up, especially in the rain. And I'm doing another video right after this on my what I packed for a day hike, which I said that in my last video, but I didn't do it yet. Okay, have a good day.